Hi guys, today we're going to be unboxing a custom Micron CMC Plus airbrush from Awata. But first of all I want to say a huge thank you to the guys over airbrushes.com who sent me the airbrush out for review. If you check the description box down below you'll find a direct link to their web store where you can find out more information about this airbrush and more great airbrushes and compressors and other equipment they sell on their web store. Okay, so without further ado, let's take a look around the box. So first of all, we can see we have all the different uh, Awata airbrushes in the Custom Micron line. Uh, and then it's telling us uh, the different applications for the different types of uh, airbrush from uh, extreme detail to fine detail, medium, wide and extra wide. And then <clears throat> as we actually open the box, the quality just jumps out of us straight away. You've got this really thick microfiber cloth wrapped around a very, very heavy case, metal case indeed. The weight of this is about a kilogram uh, with the airbrush inside. I weighed it uh, yesterday, guys, just to uh, find out how heavy it is. So it weighs about a kilogram. Um, there's a latch on the side here that if we just pull to the side we can open it up like so and inside we can see we have a custom Micron airbrush series uh, booklet which goes over uh, the care and the details of your airbrush there we can see it's showing you the crown cap that you can dock at the back which is new to the version 2 series we have a little um, leaflet here saying the uh, airbrush was tested I tested your airbrush and I uh, deemed it worthy we have an Awata sticker and here you can see the spray pattern I don't know whether my camera is able to pick up the fine lines there but if it is able to it just shows you how amazingly fine you can get these um, a, a water um, spray patterns with this custom micron it's just absolutely insane uh, okay so in the box itself we have some lubricant which is going to keep your airbrush nice and lubricated for years to come. We have a moisture trap that can be attached to the airbrush, which if you have a moisture trap on your compressor, it's like a second line of defense from any moisture getting into the airbrush, which is fantastic. You have a little spanner that's embossed with a water that's brilliant for taking off the um, fluid nozzle and then of course we have our absolutely beautiful custom micron airbrush now talking about the custom micron guys this is a very expensive airbrush there's no getting around that but this airbrush is built to last and airbrushes.com guarantee this for 10 years exclusively in the UK and that screams about the quality of this airbrush some of the key features on this airbrush is it has a brand new trigger on the version 2 which is taller and has a wider footprint on the trigger and it is absolutely silky smooth guys until you've actually tried a custom micron and actually sprayed with one it's hard to it's hard to say how beautiful they are to use uh, we have the crown cap at the front here which as I showed you um, in the video can be placed on a little dock at the back of the a preset handle there and speaking of the preset handle the preset handle has a uh, a dial that can be turned in to limit the travel on the trigger 
which in turn will give you the same exact line weights when spraying out of the airbrush every single time. We also have access to the chucking nut here. As you can see I'm moving it with my finger which helps move debris in a pinch. So to recap guys um, it's a beautiful airbrush and the main feature is the MAC valve at the front of the airbrush which stands for micro air control and with a micro air control you can actually change it by rolling in the dial there in and out to change micro increments of air pressure adjustments on the actual airbrush so you can get the most finest different uh, levels of air pressure at the front of the airbrush which is a fantastic feature to have and coupled with the fact that this is a 0.23 millimeter needle nozzle set is perfect for fine detail now as I mentioned it is an expensive airbrush but with expensive things you're going to get quality there's an age-old saying you get what you pay for and with the custom micron series you really are getting the best airbrushes so uh, guys uh, let me know what you think of the custom micron series of airbrushes in the comments field down below thank you once again to airbrushes.com for sending me out the uh, airbrush for review and thank you very much for taking your time out of the day to watch this video and I'll catch you in the next one